today on the DFR channel, we are, we're not actually, we're not working on this. We're not working on this. We're not. Sorry, guys. I know you want to see an Operation Bootcamp build video, but unfortunately, we are not going to be doing one this time. Okay, you just got to wait. You need to be patient. You need to be patient. You need to wait for the next video. This video is not about this car. It's about a different car. It's about this car right here. More specifically, more specifically about that right there. That radio. Yes, that radio's junk and we're putting a new one in it. Good for me. And of course, before we get started, guys, you know the spiel. If you know, then you know, and you can skip this part. But if you don't know, we are selling the Operation Bootcamp Build t-shirts. Do me a favor, check out the first link down in the description, Limitless Workshop backslash Diablo Formula Racing and buy yourself an Operation Bootcamp Build t-shirt. They're fully sponsoring the purchase of that t-shirt is fully sponsoring my kids integra build the one you just seen a little bit ago while he's in marine corps boot camp down in paris island um till the end of september he'll be graduating and he does not know it's happening it is a huge freaking surprise so we're rebuilding the car we're doing a whole bunch of stuff we're going to wrap it we're going to put new tires on the mutegi wheels that he has and we're doing a whole bunch of other little things check out the previous videos to get an update on what we've done so far if you want to support the build and give a gift give back give back to a future marine this is the best way to do it, guys. Go down, first link in the description, buy yourself a t-shirt. They're only $25, very, very cheap, and uh, enjoy, guys. But let's get started on the video, guys. All right, guys, so we got a new product here for the GTP, and I have to say I'm very, very happy to have it. And they've been a long, long time sponsor of the channel, a Toto Radios, guys, right here. A Toto radios. You obviously know and recognize the one that's in my truck with the hand gesture where you can turn the volume up and down, switch songs with your hands, stuff like that. This is, uh, I don't think this is a hand gesture model to be honest. Nope, it doesn't look like it's just a regular model, but still a very good, very neat model. Comes with a backup camera as well, which I'll be installing. And this is the Atoto F7XE in dash car entertainment. Um, I will tell, and there's the part number, guys. If you're interested in the part number, there's the part number for the radio. It comes with all kinds of stuff. I guess this is like a lower piece, but it comes with all kinds of different uh, doodads and wiring harness and stuff like that. I'm not going to bore you with the installation of this. If you have a car, you probably know how to put a. Um, a stereo and a radio in your car that you, you know match up the wires yada 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 plug everything in slide it in the hole have a good time um so what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and we're going to install all this fun stuff there's a lot of wiring involved which is this is a camera wire which ain't that big deal it's got to be ran to the back of the car um we're going to go ahead and install everything that we have here i think this is gps or why this is wi-fi is what this is so i guess this doesn't have gps or maybe it's internal now i'm not really sure usually they come with a gps um a GPS uh, thingy too, but I guess this one maybe doesn't have it. I'm not really sure. Anyways, regardless, I can use my phone for that. That's not a big deal. But anyways, we're gonna go ahead and install this radio. And then once it's installed, once it's done, once it's all wild up, yeah, wired, wild, wired, wired. I can't talk today, it's crazy. Wired up today, guys. Um, we're gonna go ahead and show you all the bells and features and cool stuff that it can do, which I've shown you in previous videos. But if you're new to the channel, now you know, these Atoto radios are freaking awesome. They come extremely fast. I've had this, I got this one in two days, literally. They contacted me, I said, yep, I need another radio. Boom, two days later, a Toto in the mail. Very, very simple, very, very fast. Very, very good product. I have used these radios multiple times in multiple vehicles, and I have to tell you, I love them. Great, awesome company, and I continue to use them because they are such a good company. So let's get this installed. And then we'll be right back with the review. All right, guys. So we got everything all hooked up. We even got, oh, let me show you. We even got the camera hooked up too, guys, which wasn't really hard. Just ran the lines and put the camera right back there. And the quality is really, really good. Basically what I did was I ran the line from the um, head unit all the way underneath this carpet and everything into the trunk. And that worked out very, very well. First things first is I want to give you an overview. Now, this is my 99 GTP Grand Prix um, Pontiac. So you can see 
the uh, heater controls are a little blocked by this particular model um this f7 model this is the bigger model and i want the bigger model my vents are not blocked which i'm very very happy about i don't want the vents to be blocked i don't care about this down here because honestly before i go out and leave i can check it make sure it's uh where the temperature is and, and obviously you know i have blue and red on each side so i know where where uh the temperatures needs to be and i can see my main buttons down here so i just don't really see my information center so much but i'm not really concerned about that so let's turn it on and I even got my steering wheel controls to work as well with my um, my axis that I had. And I was able to program them into here as well, which is really, really cool, actually. So everything's programmed into here, and I'll show you a little bit of that here in a minute. My music might start playing because I did hook it up to my Android Auto. Yeah, it's, it's hooking up. It's Bluetoothing. Hold on a minute. Is it going to do weird stuff? Let's see. GPS signal lost. Oh, yep, yeah, there we go. Yep, yeah, there we go. Okay, so there's my Google Maps. Now, here's the beautiful thing about this, and maybe my um, one of my Toto in my truck can be updated. I don't know to have Android Auto. I don't think my my one in my Toto, my Toto S8, I don't think has this. But this has this. This single den double wide setup has this, where it has it automatically connects directly to my phone. I don't have to use Wi-Fi for GPS or anything of that nature, which is freaking amazing. It automatically goes to my music, which is freaking cool. I can go through all that stuff. Um, here's my main screen for my phone. So I can do phone calls, podcasts, Amazon music, my calendar, yada, yada, yada. I can exit, I can do maps. I can do pretty much anything that's on. I can do Skype. What else can I do here? I can customize it, which I'll probably customize. I can do Messenger. Um, it'll read me my messages because it's directly attached to my phone. Now, obviously, they also have um, uh, Apple CarPlay. So just because I have an Android doesn't mean Apple doesn't work on this. So Apple works very, very well on this as well. You have, and this is your main screen, basically your home screen. So you got micro SD, which is over on that side. So you can actually add a micro SD. And then I have a charging port that comes out, a charging USB, or they call it a phone link that's uh there then on this side hidden i have the reset button the mic and my usb that i can plug in to charge another phone i hooked up my mic which works very very well and you know this is basically what we have we have our settings our rear camera our front i wonder if a rear camera will come on oh look at that there's my rear camera my rear camera's on check that out guys so my rear camera will also come on like this if i put it in reverse and boom and it has my little lines and everything which is really cool as you can see that's the back of the shop and the quality of this camera looks really really good so i cannot complain at all i mean it looks very very good go ahead and put that back in uh, park again um what else do we have you can go to the radio which is you know yada 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 um what else do we have here go back to home go to settings then you have all your settings, which this is all touchscreen, by the way, obviously. Your Bluetooth settings, your camera settings. What's camera settings do? Rear camera input, rear camera view, normal, reverse. I don't know what that means. What's that mean? I don't know what that means, reverse. Not really sure what that means, to be honest. But obviously, I'm going to have to go through this, this whole setup. Um, park assist guide. That's interesting. I'm going to have to go through this whole setup to do the, you know, oh, equalizer settings. Um, equalizer. There's your equalizer. So you have different settings, R&B, rock. Hopefully the glare is not too bad. There we go. Uh, pop, custom, dance, jazz, hip hop, which is really, really nice. So you can pick which one you want to do. I'm not going to play music for you guys, unfortunately, because I don't want to get demonetized on this video. But there you have it, guys. It's a pretty nice setup. I've always been a big fan of my Toto radios. This here is the F7. Um, you can go down in the description below. I always have a Toto link down there. Um, I might have to change up the discount code possibly, but that's about it. But it fits in there very, very nicely, as you guys can see. It's fully adjustable, so I can actually tilt this down. I can unscrew some screws in the back, tilt it down, tilt it up. I can raise it up, raise it down if I want to. Well, it's all the way down right now, but there's different settings on the mounting points of this screen 
where I can mount it down further, up further, um, angle it further than I want. But I have it set to right here, and I actually like the way it's set up. Um, yeah, guys, you can put different backgrounds on here and stuff. These radios are freaking nice. I'm not going to lie. These radios are freaking nice. I've always liked them. I've had them in multiple cars of mine that I've owned. They sound great. They work great. My steering wheel controls. Look at that, guys. My steering wheel controls. They all work the way they're supposed to work. Um, it took a little bit to set it up. Um, let me show you where that was. I'm afraid to touch it because it took a while. It definitely took a while for me to set it up steering wheel control select key settings yeah so i got them set up they light up a blue when you press the button so if you press down and you press down here it'll light up blue and save it as a mode so then i can set all these up as well but i'm not going to mess with these because if i touch this thing and it goes back to reset mode i'm going to be very upset because it took me a while to get it figured out but i got it figured out it's it, it, not as hard as it seems press and hold select one from the list below and it does actually work my horn doesn't work though um we'll get out of there that way i don't mess with anything and mess it up but there you go guys the atoto f7 radio well guys there's the good old gtp ready to go freaking there's my old radio right there that thing's a piece of junk actually let's get a good thumbnail park this thing outside junk 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 <laughs> Well guys, that's the end of the video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Please don't forget to support Operation Bootcamp Build. Maybe we'll get in a Toto for Zach as well. Um, I know he's due for an upgraded radio, so maybe we'll hit up a Toto and see if we can get one for his Integra and do an install on that as well. Um, a nice big center screen one like that, or maybe like what my truck has. I'm sure he'll be very happy for that, but go down, first link in the description below for the Operation Bootcamp t-shirts. Go buy yourself a t-shirt, $25. It supports a good cause and a good future Marine coming back from boot camp September 30th. The shirts are only gonna be for sale until October 9th or 10th after his 10 day leaves. And then all three shirts will be released and done at that point. You will never be able to buy these shirts again unless you're buying from somebody that already owns them. Other than that guys, hit the subscribe button. Don't forget to hit that notification bell and get all videos notified to you. That way you don't miss a single one. And Instagram, Diablo Formula Racing, and deuces guys.